Well, it's the dinner hour and we sure hope you're hungry. It's Wednesday and that means another restaurant report card is coming your way. So who's making the grade this week? 7 Action News reporter Andrea Isom tells us what she found on her latest food adventure. Welcome to F -f -f Fraser. F -f -f Fraser. Where the folks sure are full of flavor and so is the food. Our first stop on the Fraser Foodie Express, a Mar Pizza. This joint is known for offering almost anything you want. Seriously, look at this menu. It is also known for having eight priority violations on its last health inspection. That's horrible, especially that washing your hands. That's unacceptable. And so are dirty utensils. No soap at the hand sinks. Plus soiled surfaces. Come on, that's where the customers chow down. We didn't have any violation in, so. So you, so you, you cleaned them all up? Yes. Everything's been fixed? Yes. See how it says violation corrected no? Yeah. So what are you gonna do about it? I do see some have been fixed. There's soap now at the hand sink, right? Yes. There's paper towels. Employees are washing their hands. Yeah. Look, the health department sets rules and standards for a reason. All for our safety and to make sure you don't get sick. You're going to do better? Yes. Now let's find out what's going on at Fred's. There are a lot of priority violations on this paper, people. Dun, dun, dun. Showing you this, this health inspection, you're well aware of all of it. I am. Seven priority violations. And John was frank when it comes to Fred's. I informed the owners of what needed to what needed to happen, what needed to be fixed and addressed. Like getting a kit to measure the cleaning solutions so things are sanitized the way they're supposed to be. Food being held at hazardous temperatures. This pizza and deli dining dwelling was only recently bought by new owners about four months ago. You think part of it's that? I think so. I think so. I hope so. I hope that's what it is. I really care about our customers and I want them to have a good experience when they come here to eat. Good luck. Appreciate good luck, sweetheart. And last we land at Abbey Lane where I hear the burgers are insane. Lee Awesome. Burgers are excellent. The best burgers in town. He just knows how to make a burger. Every day, I've been coming in here for years. Well, I hear that you are the burger master. <laughs> well, thank you. And guess what? What? You got an A on the restaurant report card. All right. All right. <laughs> Matthew is the man. Zero violations on his last health inspection. What was the inspiration behind Abbey Lane? Uh, the Beatles. Well, it's a combination between Penny Lane and Abbey Road. Abbey Lane's been here for 10 years, and clearly this cookery is sizzling. I can't wait to see and eat what's on this plate. Yes! And it was yummy yum yum to my tummy tum tum. In Fraser, I'm Andrea Isom, 7 Action News. Oh, that burger looked good, didn't you it? You do like a burger. <laughs> I like a good burger. <laughs> I have to try that. All right, thank you, Andrea, as always. All right, 64 years.